My name is Claire Postel, and I'm a licensed professional clinical counselor and ASEX certified sex therapist. The Ohio State University Wexner Medical Center's Department of Urology and the James Cancer Hospital's Cancer Supportive Care Program have teamed up to provide sex therapy services to patients and partners who are experiencing sexual changes and difficulties due to cancer and cancer treatment. It goes without saying that cancer and cancer treatment can take a huge toll on the body. People experience changes in their energy level, their weight, their bodies, as well as changes in their sexual functioning. Sexual changes are a normal part of cancer treatment, and I work with patients and partners to restore their sexuality or to develop a new satisfying sex life post-treatment. Many women go through different types of sexual functioning changes depending on their age, their type of cancer, and their treatment approach. Some of the most common concerns men may experience are difficulty getting or maintaining an erection, changes in ejaculation or orgasm, or decreased desire. Women can experience decreased desire, vaginal dryness or thinning of the vaginal tissues, pain during intercourse, or weakening or tightening of the pelvic floor muscles. Changes of loss and changes in sexual functioning can often lead to changes in one's sexual confidence and their sexual esteem. Relationships can also be impacted by cancer and cancer treatment. During treatment, relationships can thrive and couples can feel a greater sense of connection, or relationships can become more stressed or strained. It is important for couples to maintain open lines of communication in order to support one another through this time. This is similar with sexual functioning changes. Partners will need to communicate effectively to build back a healthy sexual relationship. Though one person may be going through treatment, it takes both partners to create a healthy, more functional sex life. There are things that patients and partners can do in preparation for relationship changes and sexual changes that occur due to cancer treatment. First, identify support system. Caregiver burnout can cause strain in a partnership. Have a support person outside of the partnership. Having support outside of the partnership will lessen the strain that burnout can cause on the relationship. Second, talk to your doctor and get an idea of what to expect due to treatment. Know the options that are available in restoring sexual functioning. Lastly, date your partner. Treatment can temporarily change relationship dynamics. It is important for partners to continue to be just that, partners. Go on dates, flirt, and have fun with one another during and after treatment. 